Wow. CFL picks uh, for Thursday, August 15th. We're going to talk the Red Blacks and the Stampeders. And before we do that, you guys like, share, subscribe. Use that promo code right there, L E N Y 20 Saves you 20% off your entire purchase at checkout. Picks and parlays dot net is where you got to go get terry's premium plays all that good stuff now terry you got a game here <laughs> it's all over the place ottawa and the red blacks calgary and stampeders stampeders at home minus three and a half totals at 49 and a half where are you thinking uh where where we're we going with this one yeah this one is really interesting so um, we do have injuries um uh, all teams are injured at this point of the year but we have some significant injuries this week uh, for our, quite a few teams. Uh, we've got quarterbacks returning to the CFL. Um, it's a really, really interesting week 11 in the CFL. This is the first game of the week, Ottawa and Calgary. Ottawa coming off the tie last week. A uh, very rare tie, 22-22 tie with Saskatchewan. Calgary coming off the um, road loss in Toronto. I gave out a uh, Toronto. Uh, on the free pick uh, last week, uh, basically because Calgary is excellent at home, horrible on the road, same thing with Toronto. Uh, now we come here in, with this game, and kind of the same thing, um, Ottawa, 1-2 and two in the road, 4-0-1 oh at home. Uh, so they are on the road here in this one. Calgary is still undefeated at home, 4-0, 0-5 oh, oh on the road. The issue here is the spread of three and a half for me. Um, it's a little bit much. I can see Ottawa keeping this game close, Calgary winning it late. Um, they don't care about winning by four more points. They just care about winning. Ottawa will have um, uh, a change at quarterback. Uh, Jeremiah Masoli uh, going to be starting here in this game. So I have no idea what to expect from him uh, in this game. Uh, so it's really tough for me to look at this the, the side here. I think Calgary wins, but Calgary money line is obviously um, not in my price range. So I'm going with the under here, under 49 and a half. Calgary has been very high scoring the last couple of weeks, but they have faced uh, Toronto, uh, and the Argonauts' uh, defense is uh, really really bad this year. Uh, Ottawa's last game last week, 22-22 against the Saskatchewan, or against the Saskatchewan uh, Rough Riders. Uh, and the last time these two teams faced each other in Ottawa in Week 8, Ottawa won 33-6. to So Calgary were shut down offensively here. I think we kind of see uh, Calgary score more here, obviously, in this game. But I don't think that Ottawa puts up a whole lot with Jeremiah Masoli uh, as quarterback. Uh, so I think... This might be a little bit of a stressful uh, total, but I think it just squeaks under. So I'm going with the under 49 and a half here in this one. That's fair. Maybe a, maybe a little uh, late game sweat here under 49 and a half from Terry Edelman, Red Black, Stamp Peters. Don't forget, guys, like, share, subscribe. If you haven't already, use that promo code LENNY20. Save you 20% off, picks and parlays.net, all, all Terry's premium plays. Everything over there, a little free action for Thursday CFL under. 49 and a half. I'm Detroit Lightning Picks and Parlays. That's Terry Edelman. He's over there. Uh, we appreciate you stopping by. As always, good luck, unless you're against this ticker.